What's up, y'all? The name's Tactone, and today's video is going out to anybody who is tired of dealing with the absolute bullshit clown fiesta of RNG that is today's card games. Welcome to Legends of Rune Terra. My God, what a beautiful, beautiful five days it has been. But sadly, it is coming to a close. Now, this game is not going to be out for quite a while. Uh, more like the quarter one of 2020, but there is supposedly going to be another beta testing period this year sometime in November. And honestly, y'all, I can't wait. Literally, look, look, I try to try every single game that comes to the mobile platform. And sometimes it's hard. Sometimes it's hard. I have to play these absolute dog shit games just to see if there's any potential. It was so hard. It was so hard putting down this game, man. It was so fun. And I had like, I've been on like seven or eight different accounts, trying out what all my buddies are doing, trying out every single server. And it seems fine. You know, I mean, NA was definitely uh, a little bit tougher, you know, definitely my, my, you know, what didn't perform as well on that server as I did say, you know, uh, the Latin American one, but it's cool seeing the variance of how where people are at in the world, like dictating what they're going to build. It's, it's very much reminiscent of just real card games in general. And now I know what a lot of people are thinking. Uh, Tectone, I didn't really like Hearthstone that much. So why would I try this game? Well, let me tell you, let me tell you this. This game is nothing like Hearthstone other than the availability. This game is very much a successor to Magic the Gathering. I've been playing Magic the Gathering since I was about five or six years old. Obviously, I was shit <laughs> at that age. But hey, I've been pretty good over the years and years of grinding out the local tournaments and all that jazz. It's a lot of fun. I mean, dude, straight up, this shit should be called Magic the Gathering Remastered. The game is very fun. And if that excites you, and the reason why I say that is because there's, there's no, there's no, like, there's no cards in this game where it's like, Summon Dr. Boom, summon two Boom Bots. When those things die, deal one to four damage to your opponent or their enemy minion. There's no bullshit RNG variants in that. I mean, of course, obviously, there's top deck RNG, there's mulligan RNG, all that. But when it comes down to just what the cards do, it's very much cut and dry, kind of like League in general, which is what I really love. Riot Games, if there's one thing that they do, it's when they make a video game, I know a lot of people are going to disagree with me here, okay? I know a lot of people are going to disagree, but there is, comparatively to other games, say games made by Blizzard, there is so much less variance in this card game, which is great. I found myself having to think two to three turns ahead every single game, and that's a beautiful feeling because turns out when I play a card game, I don't just want to roll the dice and hope to God Jesus kisses me, okay? Turns out, I would like to have a battle of wits, if you will. A, a intellectual warfare, if you will. And if that sounds like something that's interesting to you, then you should give this game a chance whenever it comes out. And trust me, look, dude, I know this game is going to be gigapops, right? It's going to be gigapops, obviously, because it's going to be a damn good game, and it's backed by a company who's trying extremely hard to expand right now. And uh, honestly, Riot Games, you know, look, I stopped playing League of Legends a while ago because it made me a shit person. <laughs> you know, you get into the diamond rank games and all of a sudden it doesn't matter who your friends are, everybody's going to get stabbed verbally one way or another. It's going to happen. Teammates, enemy team, everybody's getting shit talked. But this game is just me and the opponent. It's a good time. The only time to BM anybody is by using stickers. And uh, I, I found myself, I have yet to try to BM somebody. I have yet to be like, oh man, that game was bullshit. I've been having fun with this game all the way through. And uh, it's a good game, y'all. It's a real good game. Uh, if you haven't given it a shot yet, I highly recommend that you do when it comes back uh, for the next beta season. And when it comes out in 2020, um, I am going to enjoy bringing this game to my channel when it does eventually make its full global release. And, uh, yeah, if this video hasn't convinced you that, hey, Riot Games is doing something right, hopefully uh, you'll get convinced in the future and give this game a shot. So, anywho, I've been Tectone. Y'all been great. Hope y'all are having a damn good one. And enjoy the footage of uh, the last game of my beta season experience. Thanks for watching, y'all. Okay, last game of the season. And that's a pretty shit hand. Not, yeah, no, we're going to replace all three of those. 
Uh, we'll keep we'll keep glimpse in case we get the uh, the spider synergy, and we won't. Wow, <laughs> absolute trash can of a hand. Okay, all right, we'll go for it regardless. It's the last game, dude. It can't get any worse than that. We got the brood, but that's that's the, the much slower version than we wanted to get. Yeah, nothing. Absolute dead draws. Looks like it's dead draws for both of us. Thank God for that. Okay. Also, Laurent Protégé. What a card. Three mana, two four challenger. That, that's got to be one of the MVPs of uh, the beginner meta. For sure. Dude, picking your blocks, that's so insane. Okay. End your turn, dick. Oh, true, huh? Oh, <laughs> That's so stupid. That's such... That's... Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. Oh, and Zed, too. Okay, I don't see him too often. An attack of shadow with my stats. Okay, gotcha. Wow, we're pretty, uh, we're pretty hosed, huh? Yeah, wow. What an absolute shit lord of a turn. Jesus Christ. Okay, protege. We can come back though. We have a lot of comeback mechanics in this uh, in this deck. I think we'll be all right. He has no mana. He can't do shit. Hmm. Well, that's not very good now, is it? Okay, this guy is kind of going a little bit nuts. Shit, at least it dies at the end of the turn. Okay, dude, we're already at 10 on, like, the first time we played. Okay, that kind of sucks. Uh, now nah, we could. We could glimpse here, but we shouldn't. Oh, man, we are so host. Okay, at least we get a super value trade with Lauren Protégé. You get two for one, which is going to be great. And, unless he has some crazy shit, which, you know, might happen. I think we go Lucian. But what does that do for us, right? Nothing really that much. Yeah, our hand, dude, we got that, that combo was so ridiculous. Uh, we could. Okay, no, I know how we come back. All right, uh, we'll play Protégé. Yeah. But then if he plays literally, dude, he has to have a dead hand. Dude, this sucks. Okay, uh, yeah, right here. Hook him. Yep. Kill his ass. You better not have shit. Good. All right. There is a chance. There is a chance that we might be okay. The 4-4 is a real pain in the ass right now. It's a real pain in the ass. I think we're going to be done, though. I think we're going to be done. And we are good. And thankfully, he was an absolute idiot and played that shark for no reason. So that was hype. So we're cool with that. Okay, next strike. What does this shit do? A copy of me in your hand. Okay, so if it hits us directly, it'll get an extra copy. Sure. Oh, and it can't be blocked except by an ally with a, uh, with a, whatever that shit's called. Yeah, Elusive. Okay. All right. Not much we can do about that, huh? That is not good. We could just summon the Brood, which honestly might just be our best bet. I don't think getting Lucian out is going to make it that big of a difference. Nah, fine. We're going to play Lucian. We're going to play Callista. Okay, dude, we need... We need Lucian to see dudes die or find Senna. Because we need that double strike and we need that attack bonus. Dude, this guy is so aggro. It's actually so toxic. Right, the shark comes back. Well, doesn't that just absolutely suck ass? Okay. This dude here, this dude here. That's all we can do about it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, even my cat over there, if y'all heard him, is pissed off about this game. Okay, seven HP left. This is this is not looking good for us. I'm not gonna lie. This is looking uh quite quite shit for us, in fact. Let's do um Yeah, let's bring out the brood. Yeah, we need something. And this will give us a bunch of beaters at least. Don't counter. 
No, I don't think. Wait, I don't think this class is the one that can run the counter. No, it can't. Okay, maybe it could, but he didn't play it at least. That's all. That all. That's all that matters to me. Dude, the debate has only been out for like five days. Okay, I don't know everything. Okay. The momentum on his side is slowing down, and thank God for that. He was absolutely brutalizing us. Finally, we, we're gonna have a little bit of attack here. Oh, hey, that that's pretty good. <laughs> oh, hey, that's pretty good. Okay, let's do it. You have nothing, sir. You have nothing. You have something. Don't be the AOE for two. What a great card. <laughs> sure. Okay. Yeah, why not? God, oh, dude. All right. Well, we had a chance. Dude, we're... Uh-huh. Yeah, we're... Uh... We're that word we can't say on YouTube without getting demonetized. <laughs> feels bad, dude. <laughs> that feels like absolute dog shit. Okay. Okay, sure. You know? Sometimes you get them, sometimes you get got. Unfortunately... You know what? Let's just see what we would have drawn. Now look, okay? Now look, here's the thing. We may, you know what? Let's just kill him again. Let's just see what's in the deck, huh? We may have gotten absolutely obliterated. And that's okay. Because at the end of the day, we had fun. Holy shit. Okay, yeah, we got we got obliterated there. We got totally obliterated. And honestly, hey, I don't care. That deck was sick. <laughs> that was so Dude, what was that bullshit? Turn two, summon a three two and a four four? Yeah, okay. And whatever. That's kinda like that shit in uh Hearthstone. The one where you kill the egg with the other guy and you get a three two and a four four. So yeah, pretty much exactly like Hearthstone that combo at least. Eh. That's a cool as shit deck. I can't. I'm. I'm gonna build that dude's deck. That shit was sick. Yeah. Hey, last game of the season. I'm all right with that. I'm totally cool with that.